Hey there folks, welcome to the Main Man Channel. Not just the name, it's the way of life. We've got to improvise, adapt, and overcome each and every day making this cool old world. So, what we got going on here? Well, it looks like to me, whoo wee, I got me some burgers on the grill and some ribeyes. Now, it's not all, we're going to put some more ribeyes on there. It's the Main Man's birthday, it's May the 11th. I don't know when this video will get uploaded, but the Main Man's 39 years old today one year from 40 we're going to celebrate and we're also doing a little work outside too okay folks i got this rust oleum never wet here i bought it from the dollar general i bought it during it was either last year or the year before during one of those uh 50 off 50 percent clearance so clearance was already 50 percent off well let's see how it was it was already marked down you know on the clearance and uh, then I got 50% off. So I got this stuff for 25 cents a pack. It comes with a step one and step two can. There are some step one cans down there. But it's just like a treatment to help stuff from getting so wet and repel water. It what it didn't go that good. It wasn't uh, something that lasted a long time. But I mean, I had so much of it, you know, I never used it and uh, figured I might as well spray a bunch of my tables and stuff outside and i had these leftover cans after treating some of it and i believe we'll do step one today you're supposed to do step one and let 30 let it dry for 30 minutes these cans are the hill cans they're empty and i noticed these spray cans they will not spray all the liquid out when they get totally empty so what we're going to do is i thought well, why not treat the range a little bit? So since these cans won't spray the rest of the liquid out of the step one, we'll just treat it step one today, and we'll use our Rossi SR, I mean, excuse me, our Rossi uh, 22. So, like I said, cans are set up downrange. We got our Rossi RS-22. This will be the second time we've shot it, okay? And uh, figure it's going to be accurate enough to hit those cans. And we're going to shoot the crap out of those cans, even if it takes 20 rounds. I'll get the two magazines loaded up, and we'll get on that. I'm going to put you all on the stand down there. That way you can see it. And uh, we're going to weather treat the range. All right. And, yes, I did get groomed a little bit. I didn't show. But I did get groomed, and this is kind of what the main man looks like groomed. And, of course... I'm supporting, it's my birthday, but I'm supporting my NRA t-shirt with all the bullets on my back. I bought a tractor supply, so that's pretty cool. Yep. Say what you want to about the NRA. They got a lot of problems, but still, I try to support all the gun rights organizations because I believe in the Second Amendment. So anyways, enough talk. I'm going to put you all on the stand down there, and we're going to shoot the crap out of these cans and see what happens. Okay, folks, got our earplugs in, we got our mags loaded up, and we're ready to go. We're going to put 20 rounds of Winchester Super X, the lead tip, in these uh, bad boys down here and uh, these cans and see if we can't weather treat the range real quick. Here we go.
Okay, folks, let's go back up here and talk. Well, okay, folks. So, the first 10 shots worked good. That first magazine, I don't think it had any trouble at all. It worked, worked just fine. Uh, all 10 rounds of the Winchester Super X. But then we had three light primer strikes on this one right here. So I'm thinking one of my magazines might be a little bit faulty. Maybe, maybe not. But it seems like I'm having real good luck out of one magazine and not the other. But anyway, like I said, we're going to do, it's not really a round two. We're just trying to weather treat the range, but it didn't make, that stuff didn't come out like I thought it would. But uh, we shot the crap out of those cans. Had a little fun. Well, we're actually going to do a round two video where I'm going to shoot several rounds through this thing and uh, and uh, see what's up with it, try to figure it out. But uh, rifle's pretty accurate. Uh, you know, everything, and it shoots pretty good, and it's fun. I'm sorry we didn't get the, the cans work. Didn't have enough in them to be, uh, you know, too explosive like well like I was hoping and treat the range but uh like I say we got to shoot them have a little bit of fun and uh let's check and see what's going on in the grill before we go let's see how our grill's doing real quick oh yeah looks like it's time to flip this meat starting to look good anyway folks thank y'all for watching the main man channel main man's gonna get some of this birthday food cooked probably shoot a little bit more with that RS 22 I'll catch y'all next time